lead into his uncharted right. territory. A few of these men straight to the back of Wonder Boy's head, if I'm being straight. modest. But great job of Dorino. Okay. And it seems as though he gets the victory tonight. Yeah, well, yeah, hopefully it's um, just patriotism. Here, let me mute it. For the booze for Gilbert Dorino. So, the first round was a range finder round. Very uh, wide stance by uh, Stephen Wonderboy Thompson. Uh, Burns, you can tell that, you know, he was having some issues getting on the inside. He did score a takedown, but nothing came from it in round one. Round two, in my opinion, was a clear Wonderboy round. Um, Burns did get a takedown at about the 32nd mark or so with 30 seconds or so left in the second round really didn't get anything done but round one was a feeling out round you can really really say that burns won that round round number three clear burns round besides that uh spinning um back kick by stephen thompson he took him down got the takedown earlier exactly when he needed and they're about to read the cards right now and at 38 years old many are wondering where stephen wonderboy thompson is going to go from here but at the same time he's not done it's just that Styles make fights. Let me turn it back up. Please take your time out. Like the video, subscribe. Payment, visit I like this fight. The night has been moving fast with these with fights. The and as you can see on the Buffett. channel, I've been covering all of the after three fights rounds, of the main cards. We go to the judges' scorecards for decision. Listen in, please subscribe. All three judges score this contest. 29, 28 for the winner by unanimous decision, Gilbert Dorinja Perfect. Let's listen to the post fight. All right, I'm here with the winner, Gilbert Burns. Gilbert, congratulations on another excellent victory. Back on the winning track and against one of the most puzzling fighters in the division. How difficult was it fighting his style? Sorry, guys. Every time that I step right here, I try to get a finish. It's a complicated one. Let's go, boo. I don't care. Let's go. More. I need more. Let's go. Wonderboy is one of the most complicated guys to fight, but you were very successful and able to get him down to the ground. That that played a big part of your victory. Yeah, shout out to my guy Raymond Daniels came all the way to San Francisco to help out. Yeah, Jason that was Jackson, it. That really, Andrew really Manish, was it. Coach Henry Hoof, Coach Daniel, Coach Kami, Coach Greg Jones, Wagner Russia. Those guys make me so ready. They're super tough. They push the best out of me. And the three still alive. The three still alive. They get his ears jabbed off. So hard. This puts you right back Bayou's in the contention, Gilbert. So give us your thoughts on who you'd like to face next. Anyone can get it, Joe. Anyone. Oh, hey, if you want some, come and take it. Nate, let's see who the real gangster is. Leo, you can take as well. Let's go. The title's coming soon. Let's go. Congratulations, sir. Gilbert Burns, ladies and gentlemen. Gilbert Burns with a monumental here, a win tonight. Minute. 13. My bad. Um, here is the 170 pound division in, in, in UFC welterweight is one of the most stacked divisions. I can say that despite of the fact that you have, you know, Nate Diaz kind of part timey ish. Nonetheless, from my understanding, Usman versus Covington is next. A date, you know, I don't, I'm guessing it's going to be in September, right? Um, Burns, number two, him and Leon Edwards makes sense, but Leon Edwards wants Masvidal or Nate Diaz. You know, those, those are, you know, uh, money fights. You have Steven uh, Wonderboy right there who's still, like, in the mix. So to move on to the main event, and also I've been sitting here for hours. I need to go take my dog out to go take a piss. Um, I'm T-Street Controversy with FightV360.com. We cover every single major fight live. We will be back for the main event and the post-fight press conference. Please subscribe.